Hey you guys, welcome back. So I just got back from Wendy's. Oh, long day, kind of like a long night more so. But I just got back from Wendy's and I decided let me do a quick mukbang. All right, so I just got a, um, I always get this sandwich. It is the Asiago Chicken Club Ranch Sandwich and it looks like this and they got the Asiago sauce, tomatoes, iceberg lettuce, bacon, and cheese. And yeah, so I'm just going to get right in and start eating. I got me a cup of water right here. And I also got me Frosty and some fries. It's like pretty basic. I didn't really get nothing spectacular. Mmm. So good, so good, so good. I know you hate it. Mm. Mm. We just got out of a meeting today. <sighs> About some business opportunities. We just don't know if we're gonna do it for sure. Now do some more research. I got my chocolate frosty right here. It's like really light in color, so. It was so dark in this room, so. Mm. Mm. Let me know if you guys like dipping your fries inside your Frosty. Mm -hmm. I know I do. And yes, I got my robe on because I just wanted to be comfy. I was on clothes all day. So I just wanted to be comfortable when I was eating. So I put my robe on. But I was super excited to get out the house today, you guys. Well, I got a little mommy break too. I'm not gonna lie. So I was happy about that. I can get out, go talk to some people. About some business or whatnot. Your girl is trying to get into something more rewarding. I'm, I'm more, I'm, guys, I'm really an independent person. Like, I honestly cannot stand working underneath people. I worked at various retail stores, fast food places. And I know probably with those jobs, people might be like, well, yeah, you might not like it because of that. But honestly, genuinely, I just don't want to work underneath anybody. All my fries are gone. Like, I'm the type of woman, you know, I gotta be my own boss. Period. Period, point blank. Mmm, this sandwich is so good. Mmm. 
Mm -hmm. I mean, it's great. If I decide to work underneath someone, because <clears throat> I know that I eventually want to do my own thing, so I would just be saving all of my coins and putting it towards, you know, my own business. So, it's not totally all bad to work underneath somebody. I just cannot do it long term. I just won't be the final outcome. I will be working towards something, like, of my own. You know what? And it's not for everybody. Because I know some people, right now, they don't have a business mindset. They don't want their own business, which is totally fine because the job that they have is very rewarding. And they enjoy it. So, you know, everything is not for everyone. But for me, the type of person that I am, I'm just like an independent person. Like I need to be doing my own thing on my own time. My own way. Answer to myself. That's just what I discovered over the years of like working for people, you know? I got to Oh. Uh. Ooh. Uh. <clears throat> mm hmm. I had a brain freeze. By the way, it went away fast because you put your tongue on top of your mouth and it goes away. I couldn't do fast food because you guys, I actually ended up getting hired at Dunkin Donuts one time and I was so mad because no one was training me. They just was keeping me on a computer. And I actually ended up getting hired with a friend at the time who is no longer my friend. We both actually ended up getting hired at Dunkin Donuts. And they trained her, they helped her out, um, and she was good with me. They had me sitting at a computer watching some dumb training course, and I wasn't learning anything from it. It was, it was re really retarded. It was nothing like actually getting out there on the floor <clears throat> and... Completing orders and doing all that stuff. So I literally quit that job in like a week. And I was done. That was years ago. What else happened? When I in school. I think I ended up dropping out of college too. I have my daughter. Well, no. I, mm -mm. I'm moving too fast.
Dunkin' Donuts was way before I went to school and had my daughter, so. Mm. Yeah. I don't think I worked with that. I don't think I actually ended up getting pregnant around that time. And I was sick as a dog. Every single day. Had my daughter. Went to college. Dropped out of that really quickly. Started my first YouTube channel. Which was a beauty channel and makeup channel. Blew up. Well, that, okay, that's extreme. I didn't blow up. Because obviously, I will probably still be doing it. <laughs> but um, I think in like the first couple months, I had like 2,000 subscribers just like fly. And like quick. Six months, 10,000. Like out of nowhere. But then... Um, life was happening, inconsistency a lot, and yeah, you know, I went months without uploading. You didn't realize what I was really having because YouTube at that time for me was like a hobby, something to do, some, some fun to get out there. And I was really into makeup and beauty and all that stuff. So, I, you know, I really didn't realize, um, the benefit of YouTube at that time, and this is like about four years ago um, when I first started that, that my beauty channel. So I really didn't realize like the benefits of it. <clears throat> so I ended up um, coming back and forth. It took a while to get to 15,000 subscribers. But even with that, my view count was going down, but it's still kind of fair. So I ended up hitting like 20,000 subscribers, maybe like a year later. Um, and literally my views were like completely low. Like for, <coughs> for my channel to weigh my subscribers, 20,000 subscribers and you will only get like a hundred views, maybe even less. Hmm. So it's almost been, so one day I just decided to like delete it. That was almost two years ago when I deleted that channel. Kind of wish I never did, but, I, you know, I don't regret it. I just wanted to see, you know, since I find myself back on YouTube, even though I'm in a different niche, what that would have, what it would have been like, you know. But, you know, stuff happens. I'm fairly happy over here in the mukbang world. Really enjoy it. Hope you guys do too. Ugh. You guys, this is a frosty. And I need to eat that in moderation. I got another brain freeze coming. So, I don't know. It's really good though. Sheesh. Mm. Oh, I need to slow down. Ah! Uh, chest, okay. Oh, my chest. Okay, I gotta stop. See, I really have to eat it in moderation. My chest starts to freeze, or I get a brain freeze, or something like that. Alright, so I guess I can finish off the story. It's been like two years. Almost two years since I deleted that beauty channel of mine. Um, so yeah, I decided to come back to YouTube and actually do something. I mean, not that I, I enjoyed, trust me. I enjoyed my beauty channel a lot. 
Um, so I decided to come back to YouTube. And yeah, do this instead. I don't was this video everywhere? I'm sorry. It's late. It's <laughs> it's late. Cause I really, really, really want to stick to these videos and I really want to just make sure we're doing all of these 12 days. And so far it's so good. I think this is gonna be day six. Yeah, this should be day six of 12 days of Christmas. <laughs> Sorry, I get a little goofy at night because I get a little sleepy and I'm ready to wind down. So I don't know, I just get like this one last like energy burst. So if I'm talking way too much, I do apologize, you guys. Okay, we've been doing it six days straight. <laughs> Which is good. Because, you know, it's more of a goal for me, you know. actually sticking to something I said I was gonna do and it was actually hard because I wanted to eat with my kids with my family and it's like oh but I'm like I gotta go do this because I'm more excited I'm, I'm excited about doing this too so it's like you know bittersweet um so yeah um yeah so I started this channel and I feel good I feel really, really good I do I feel good I do so, that's that. <coughs> Let me try to finish my frosty. Because I want to finish everything on, on for you guys. I hope my brightness is not up too high. But yeah, um... So, I would love to get to 100 subscribers by the end of this summer, you guys. I think we can do it. I really have some face we can do it. I can see it. Look, you guys. I finished everything. Frosty is gone. Burger and fries are gone. We're all done. My water, okay, I'm not gonna finish my water. But the food is gone. So guys, let's get some water. December. That will start my new year off so great. I will be so happy. Um, it will mean a lot to me for you guys to share my videos and thumbs them up right here. I don't know why I'm being like extremely goofy. Am I talking too much in this video or no? Are you guys no? Okay. I don't know. Uh, uh, uh. All right, guys. So that's it. Yeah, I need to shower. I need to shower. <laughs> And get in a bit. I got videos to edit. So, all right, guys. Thank you so much for watching. And I'll see you guys day seven. <laughs> Bye now.